Hi Fire Signs, Aries, Sagittarius, Leo. Welcome back to my channel and thank you for tuning into your tarot reading. Today we're going to be looking at what is your person about to do next. So we'll see what their next course of action is towards you and towards your relationship. Um, so it is channel for the Fire Signs. Uh, and also to the cross watchers, you may find, find traces of yourself in this reading. Um, before I begin, please subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Um, and if you wanted to become a channel member, you will get access to extended and bonus readings each month and member only content. Otherwise, let's have a look and see what is your person about to do. There's an Aries coming through. Uh, someone's about to offer you the world. We've got an Aquarius here with the star card. Okay, um, this is speaking of destiny. So I feel like someone's about to change, make you an offer that's going to change your destiny, fire signs. This is powerful. Um, if you're currently single, there's someone here that's making a huge offering. And I'm seeing marriage in the cards. This is someone's offering you something big. They're about to make an offer to make something exclusive, to take you away from single life or even offer you marriage. Um, okay, they're about to fulfill a huge, huge wish of yours. It's something that you've wanted for a long time or it's something you've wanted in a relationship or you've wanted someone to do this for you. It could be like taking you on a holiday, making something special for you, um, buying you a car or an asset. Like it's something that's pretty big. So that's why I feel like it's a grand gesture. Um, and I really feel like you're going to be very happy with what you get, fire signs. I see you celebrating with the four of wands. So someone wants to do something in, in honor of like a celebration here for you. Uh, it may be like a birthday thing. It could be like they want to throw you a housewarming party. Um, I feel like there's someone here that's going to like surprise you in a way, but it's with like an event. So it could be like, um, so it could be like a baby shower or, you know, it could be like having after work drinks. Like it's something that they want to do for you. It's something special. And I feel like it's some sort of celebration. You know, maybe you recently got a new job and this person wants to throw a party for you um they want to plan something here so i feel like they're going to do something in the physical sense um yeah and they're going to plan this for you so i think that's very exciting as well i also feel like the magician this is like someone famous or someone well known so i get for some of you fire signs someone's going to be this person's like um going to go out there and buy your favorite book by a certain author or <clears throat> organize a meet and greet for you or book a concert that they know of someone that you really enjoy and really love their work so i feel like they're going to do something that you're um they're going to plan this concert or this uh, going to a fancy restaurant that they know that's been on your bucket list or maybe like an activity that they've known that you've wanted to do for a long long time and they're going to do it i see them spending a little bit of money on you especially with the king of pentacles so we've got Aries, Aqua, or Taurus, so they may be under these signs, but this is like pretty extravagant, especially this last column. So I get for some of you, they're going to do something quite lavish. Um, for some of you, they could surprise you with a new home. Okay, they might buy a house, put a down payment on a house, maybe even pay like a deposit. They could even buy you like a car, a secondhand car. Uh, a phone, they, it's some sort of gadget that they know you need or it's an asset that they know you need and they're going to spend quite a bit of money to make that happen here for you. Four out of the five cards are earth cards, so there's a strong earth sign here. In particular, that Taurus could be a Cappy or a Virgo as well. Uh, they could also get you, for some of you, this person is like getting you like a piece of jewellery or it's like a very sentimental piece um, and it honors either you, your history or your relationship together. So it could be like an anniversary gift. It could be buying you a ring from a place where you first met. Uh, it could be some sort of token, like a memorabilia, talisman, something very sacred and special. It doesn't have to be like over expensive, but it's meaningful. There's meaning behind it uh, for the both of you. And I feel like they may present that um, they may present that for you. For others, I feel like some of you, this person is lending you money and it's not really like a, 
I have money I can lend to you or you need help and I've got more power type thing. It's not so much that. It's more like I care about you and I want you to have this because I want to show you I can look after you. So I don't get that it's coming from a place of ego uh, or, a, or a place where they want power or control over you fire signs. It's more like you know, you might be out there needing money or you want to buy yourself something and you can't afford it, this person is sort of going to step up and show you, look, I can take care of you. You can rely on me when you need to. And I don't think there's an expectation attached to this. I don't see them to really be counting their money. I think it's more like coming from a place of them trying to reassure you that they can take care of you financially. They, w they want you to feel comfortable with them uh, is what I'm getting. They want you to have that, that element of comfort. Um, so that's why they're doing what they're doing here for you, um, to show you that. Okay, for some of you, I feel like there is, there's something about healing that's taking place. And I feel like it may be a conversation or there's someone here who wants to prove to you or is about to prove to you that they've healed from a situation. Like, so if you've recently had an argument from this person, they're coming forward maybe with an apology and they're about to show you like, yeah, I'm mature in this. I'm going to move past this because I want to be with you. I want this to move forward. Uh, or it's like they want to show you they've healed or they've forgiven you. If forgiveness has been needed in this connection, they want to show you that, um, that they have it in them to forgive you yeah that's that's interesting but yeah it's coming up quite strongly so i feel like it is connected to what i'm seeing here mm. but they really they're really going to wish they fulfill a wish here for you um this is coming up very powerfully it could be a water sign and a cancer pisces or scorpio that's coming in this is the water bearer here uh, and I really feel like they want to fulfill a wish for you, but they want to show, I get, I'm, I get that someone here is about to show you off to like someone, like a family member or friends or like social, the social media world, maybe making things official. There is someone here who I feel like wants to make things super, super official with you. Uh, so yeah, they, they, they want to make it happen. They do. Could be a new beginning. Someone's healed from your previous connection and there might be someone here returning. So you may hear from someone who's been single or you haven't heard from. They've been doing their own thing. And then all of a sudden, they're just going to come up, pop up on social media. I get like you're going to connect like online, on Facey, on um, Instagram, Twitter, whatever it is. You're going to connect online with this person. You might even match with this person you haven't been in touch with you might even match online or on dating app and like that's destiny at play here so i feel like whatever they're about to do here for you fire signs know that it's destined and it's something that's going to make you super super happy so i love that that's come up in the cards here for you but i'm going to wrap it up there so thank you again airy Saglio, for watching it really does mean the world to me don't forget to subscribe to the channel if you haven't already um, and become a member if you wish to do so Otherwise, I'm sure I'll catch you very soon. So thanks again, everyone. All the best. And until next time, bye for now.